Okay, hello. That's working. Yes, we're back in the infinite regression. Where time stands still, and you obey the words of my voice. Take all your money and send it to me. Anyway, regardless. Uh, we're doing another game review. It's like the fifth one in a day. How can he do so many? Uh, well, it's called Low Production Values. Anyway, and it's called Having a Lot of Games. A lot of games to review. Anyway, uh, yeah. So after the, you know, pretty good, pretty solid uh, 8-Bit Boy, let's find out what Abandoned Night is all about. Always a good sign when this is black. There is community content. This. Okay, I'm going to withhold comments. Because there are some modern games that I have enjoyed that have had janky. Okay, you have Pockner. You have America. Alright, do I... Anyway... And this is, let's see if we can get it directly in the corner. Nope, nope, nope. I'm not controlling it, by the way. I wish I were. Please let it be directly in the corner. Wait, why is it going up? I want it to be in the corner. No. Okay, that, that in and of itself is disappointing and upsetting. Wait, does this guy get sorted in the helmet? <laughs> okay, we're going to find out. Uh, obviously, wait, are there, there are 13 levels, an unlucky 13, ooh, did a monster just peer over the walls? Okay, there's a mobile game that I used to play called Sword of Fargol, and the graphics on that were not the best, but like, the gameplay was excellent. It was a very fun game to play. You know, reasonable difficulty. Okay. Ooh, look at my knight. He looks abandoned. Okay, E. Okay, E. Drink of water. Wait. Oh. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what this means. When my water cup right here is full, then I'm good. When my water cup is empty, then I'm dead. Okay. So watch your what? Oh, do I drink water to, like, gain energy? Oh, there's a dude already. I don't know how to hit. Oh, F. <laughs> Ooh, the, the power of the hit. Wait, hold up. Hold the phone. Are you telling me? Okay, let me connect a controller. Okay. Nope. Oh, wait, no. That oh, 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 ah. Okay. There we go. Now we're going to sort this guy in the face. Okay. Uh. Oh, no. How many HP does he have? Yeah, we sorted him. Okay, let's find out what to do. I opened the chest. How do I... What did, oh, I think I got some coins. I think I coined it in. Okay, all right. You know, the music to this is like reasonably solid. I, yeah, I wonder if perhaps, okay, what is this telling me? Like, put the blue thing on the pyramid? Put the blue, oh, oh. Do I, is that a shield? Am I now shielded? Because I touched the pyramid of power? Yes. Wait, okay, now I'm sorting. Okay, where else can I go? Can I go anywhere else? Come on, game. I see, oh. Hey, there's got to be another side of this wall. I see more floors. Okay, come on. Do I need to carry the good word of having a thing on top to this pillar? Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, that that's how I passed the level? 
That did not make an awful lot of sense to me, but I'm gonna... Oh, holy smokes. Okay, we're gonna need these water cups, because that... I'm seeing saw blades. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, killed him. Okay. Wait, 292? I wish there was a better animation for getting stuff out of a chest. Like, it doesn't make a chest sound. Like, you gotta have a little ear, like, creak. But take the one that I just made with my voice and add it in. I'll let you, like, I, oh, God. Oh, no, oh, no. What? Did I just... Use your dexterity, G the run. What does that even... Oh. Wait, did I get hit for water and then, like... Did that thing take my water? Is what I need to... Wait. I don't see my water going down. Am I getting hit? I don't know what's happening. I... I can't tell. Oh, I lost some coins, apparently. Okay. What? Yeah, apparently it's bad. I didn't see my water level. Use your dexterity. G the run. Okay. I gotta find out what on this controller G is. Because, like... Okay. The... The controller scheme, the way that they have it, is... Uh, okay. Wh what? I was just trying to pause the game, and it went out of the menu. Okay, this is not good. Not good signs. I want to like this game. I'm not turned off by its kind of, you know... <coughs> you know, silly type graphics. Like, I mean, they're not perfect by any stretch of the imagination but it's not a deal breaker for me like i played a lot of old games with a lot of crap graphics i mean i still enjoy playing adventure on the atari and the main character in that is literally a square is a square it's like a four pixel by four pixel square and that dude like, changes color every time you enter a new zone of a different color. So, like, you know, I think that hit the corner, sort of. Anyway, regardless. But, like, yeah, the graphics aren't turning me off. It's that I don't know what I'm doing. And, you know, it's not giving me a lot of feedback as to how to do this but i'm telling you the controls as they were laid out because it wanted me to use wasd and then it wanted me to use f which is like no i mean there are lots of games that use the q and the e key because they're right next to your wasd and you can sort of you know it's like doing drive-bys and grand theft auto those are the keys but like you don't want to reach over to f from d that's I don't want to, and I mean, F, okay, sure, it's one key over, but G, that's two keys over, and that's the key to run, apparently? Anyway, do not like that. So I'm gonna try and find what my run key is on this. I don't know what my... Yeah. Do I look like I'm running faster? Do what point? Wait, if I hold G. Oh, but it takes my water. It takes, you can't have my water. I need that for life. Okay. I don't like that there's no, that there's not a lot of uh, audible or visual feedback in this game like when I open this chest I get coins does it make a coin sound nope it does not no coin sound whatsoever uh, okay okay I've got the thing that you need 
Okay, if I just go over here, can I bypass that dingus? Uh, what? It wasn't even, I was... Mmm, hitboxes, people. I think they extend it, like, a lot of your worst Nintendo games back in the day would, like, they would have hitboxes that were, um, like, exactly the character's size or even slightly bigger than your character. And you don't want that. You don't want to, like, have a hitbox that is... Okay. Whoa! Try to game me, will you? Oh, there are two devils. It's like that song about six red devils around the clock. You know that song. Just kidding, nobody knows that song. Like, if you know that song, then... Okay, I'm not that guy who's like, uh, comment, and subscribe. If you know six red devils around the clock without googling it put in oh i don't have the e thing ah some of the bench not the entire bench obviously oh good <laughs> use your dexterity g the run uh <laughs> i just want to see what level three is because i you know like yeah, I also don't know what advances it when it says use your dexterity G the run. Like, I don't know what makes it go from that screen to, like, me playing again. Oh, jeez. And how did I not get hit there? I've clearly been hit by things similar to that. And how is he getting hit? Like, my first swing on him was clearly not close. Anyway, get my coins. Anyway, uh, let's find out. Er, oh! I did not use my dexterity G the run. Oh, okay, okay. I think I found out which button advances it. I've just been button mashing. Oh, I thought... Okay took one more hit than I thought he should, but... And why are my coins different? Like, my coin totals make no sense from life to life. Like, I just... More coins, less coins. How many coins? Who knows how many coins. Like... Okay, but this is gonna be the run. You're gonna see. You're gonna find out. Okay, hold up. Wait for it, wait for it, go. G the run. G the run, dude. G the run, be the run. Uh, ha ha. Two devils. Get these six red devils around the clock. Mm. Oh, you better not touch me. I wanna find out what level three is about. Okay. Yes, I did it. Take that, haters who said that I couldn't do it. <laughs> Wait, can I put, like, can I just go to level four? Okay, it's not unlocked. But look at the very slight color difference between unlocked and locked levels. It is, like, I guess there's a transparency sort of, kind of, but not really. You know what would be easier? Is make the locked ones red and the unlocked ones green or blue. <laughs> like, I swear to God, the number of things that I see game creators mess up that are like the easiest thing. You know, it's like, look, I know that you are trying to reinvent the wheel, but you don't have to. Like, just use pre-built wheels it's fine nobody will say like no oh, it's, it's an okay game but he you know pre-built wheels anyway like just use the standards of the genre that you are creating a game in this game so far uh is not that fun <laughs> It's really kind of a pain in the neck because I'm having to use a controller 
which like the game is seeing my controller as a mouse not as a controller so i'm basically mousing my way through it kind of and um it yeah, it's, it's not going very well. And there are just certain keys that I obviously don't have key presses for, like the sprint one. But when I use the actual sprint key on my keyboard in conjunction with the controller, it did not go well either. Because the sprint is ridiculously hard to, like, it's hard to tell when it's going to start sprinting and when it's going to stop. And the fact that the Sprint uses up your drinking water, like, that's no good. Because the first sign in the game told me that drinking water equals life. Which is pretty accurate to how life works. Anyway. Oh, is this big boss level? Oh, no. Oh, I think it's boss time. <laughs> oh, no, I just took a hit. That's, that's me taking a hit. Drink water. Oh. Wait, how do I tell? I hope you have patience. <laughs> not as much as you think. Wait, can I not? Okay. Uh, I don't. Yeah, my coin totals make no sense. Okay, where is the pillar? Yeah. So I just E that, and then I just have to survive long enough to get over here. And that's the boss battle? That just... Oh, what? It wouldn't go on the pillar. Okay, that's my interaction button, obviously. I mean... Come on, Charlie Brown. Here we go. Don't act like you don't know that... The Oh, so I can't put it on there without... So, how am I supposed to defeat this doofus? Do I hit his things back at him? Just hope that I have patience. I can't hit it. Oh, you. Okay, this is real. Like, it was kind of funny how not good this was before, but now this is really, really wearing me down. I can't get in... Ugh. Okay, let me see. Like, there's no... Okay. We're gonna bum rush him. Wait, let's see. What does H do? No, H is my... I'm trying to... Some of the bench. Nope. Nope. I'm sorry. Nope. 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 Oh, yep. See, I didn't even check which category I had this in. This is a terrible game. This is this is terrible. Hold up. Pause. Okay. Okay. I'm back. And look, I'm, it didn't take me that long to think of a score, to think of a thing that I wanted to put on a picture that I could lazily show you rather than tipping this in as footage in the freaking video and being like, yeah, I added it into the video and there you go. That's what the score is. Nope. Nope. I'm too lazy for that. I just do a screen capture and then I... Uh, show you what the freaking um, thing is that I made in Pixlr because I don't have Photoshop. Anyway, regardless, let me show you what the final score of this game is, as if you didn't know. It stinks. It stinks. Put a clothespin on your nose and, like, slink away. Man, this guy <laughs> has serious forehead problems. <laughs> Like, his brain must be minuscule. Like, that is... Ugh. Yeah. This is some free clip art that I found. And I, I just was like, clothespin on nose. Because that's what this game... I just want to be like, ugh. They don't even want to smell it. It's, I could, it's like... Stink lines are emanating from my computer. That's how bad it is. Like... Brand new computer, just got it. 
and it's like already it's like uh stink lines we are making stink lines because you made me play a game that is garbage yeah this is a terrible game i gave it every chance every possible freaking chance and it just sucked and i hated it anyway how to beat that boss i don't know i don't know don't care at this point i just it bothers me that like if you create a game you have to give feedback like the the game needs to make sounds when you take a hit it needs to make sounds when you pick up an item the number of coins that you have from like uh, if you die and then start again you shouldn't have more coins than when you i mean these are all just basic just basic things basic freaking things and the thing about this game is that i don't even feel like so with uh 28 waves later uh it was 28 waves later 28 days later i can't remember that very memorable 28 waves later that very memorable zombie game that i played like that one there's like pieces of a salvageable game like a little more effort on some of the textures for the ground and for the buildings, a little more effort and just a few areas and you have yourself a playable game. You know, not the greatest game of all time, but a playable game that you don't feel like a sucker for having spent money on. Um, now, I didn't buy this. This was Russian hackers. I hope they got it for free because if they spent like, even if they were using a stolen credit card, I think, like, I feel bad. I feel bad all around. Like, even if, if, if it was purchased with fraud, like, I just can't even... Ugh. What a terrible gameplay experience. Just bad. I, there's no excuse. Anyway, I'm gonna stop because I'm still angry at this stupid game. Alright, everybody. Hope your life is better than this game. Stare into the infinite void and let it embrace you because guess what? This right here, waving my mouse around, is a better game than Abandoned Night. Oh look, it's got a trail and it goes off into the distance. The graphics are pretty decent. You know, I know what the gameplay is. I know what all these buttons do. Oh look, they highlight when I hover over them. And, you know, there's... Ugh, God, so many things wrong with this stupid game. Don't buy it. Just kidding. You can't. It's no longer on the Steam store. And it should no longer be anywhere except uh, littering a landfill in New Mexico. Anyway, if you get that reference, kudos to you. Doff of the cap. All right, people. We will see you in the next one. Bye.